Hey everyone, welcome back to Terramator Gardens and welcome to another series, Native Plants Around the World, where we explore the incredible plants that define ecosystems and cultures. In today's episode, we're focusing on the rich biodiversity of Mexico and highlighting some remarkable plants that not only grow naturally in this region, but have also played a critical role in sustaining life. These plants aren't just food, they're deeply connected to the land, culture, and history of Mexico. First, we have maize, or corn, which is one of the most significant plants native to Mexico, more than just a food crop, maize was domesticated thousands of years ago and became the backbone of Mesoamerican agriculture. Its ability to adapt to different climates and soils across Mexico shows the resilience of this plant. Maize plants are wind pollinated and their deep roots in Mexican history connect us to ancient civilizations. Next is the avocado, a plant native to the forests of South Central Mexico. Avocado trees can live for hundreds of years and thrive in the subtropical regions of Mexico. The fruits, rich in healthy fats, were highly valued by ancient cultures for both their nutritional and medicinal properties. Beyond food, the avocado plant holds ecological importance, providing habitat and food for various wildlife species. The tomato, although often associated with modern agriculture, originally grew wild in the highlands of Western South America and was domesticated in Mexico. Its small, wild ancestors still thrive there, showing the plant's diversity and adaptability. Tomatoes are part of the nightshade family, with their flowers supporting local pollinators like bees and butterflies. Chili peppers are another plant group that originated in Mexico. These plants have evolved in a wide variety of forms and flavors from sweet to fiery hot. Chili pepper plants thrive in different ecosystems across Mexico, from arid deserts to tropical forests. Their vibrant flowers attract pollinators, and the capsaicin in the fruits is not just for human taste, it evolved as a defense mechanism to deter herbivores. Vanilla, the only edible fruit of the orchid family, is native to Mexico's tropical regions. It's a climbing vine that thrives in humid, shaded environments, often using trees as support. The intricate relationship between the vanilla plant and local pollinators like the Milipona bee is a fascinating example of co-evolution in the natural world. Cacao is native to the lowland rainforest of southern Mexico. This tree not only produces the seeds used to make chocolate, but also plays a key role in the ecosystem as a shade-tolerant species that helps maintain the structure of the forest understory. Its large pods and complex pollination process depend on small insects, emphasizing the interconnectedness of the rainforest life. Guava is another plant native to Mexico and surrounding regions. Known for its fragrant fruits, the guava tree is highly adaptable, thriving in both tropical and subtropical climates. Its hardiness and ability to bear fruit in various conditions make it a valuable plant, not just for humans, but for wildlife that depend on its fruits for sustenance. These are just a few of the fascinating plants native to Mexico that have shaped its biodiversity and ecosystems for millennia. In the next episode, we'll continue our journey through another country's native flora. If you're passionate about plants, be sure to subscribe and join as we explore the wonderful world of native plant species. Thanks for watching. Stay rooted.